in this segment, getting the lawyer. You're going to need a lawyer, of course, when you're franchising. The documentation is horrendous. The disclosure documents, something I want to tell you about disclosure documents. One of the reasons you want your systems, you want those franchisees to succeed. It puts money in your pocket. If the systems are right, they will, if they follow them. So make it possible they follow them. And it all has to be within your systems manual as well as your disclosure document. In your disclosure document, you're going to have to say if you've had any businesses that have not made it. It's going to have to be in there. You want to be able to provide in that disclosure document phone numbers of successful franchises that you already have so that they can make the phone calls and see how they feel about it. Now, you may be starting out and say, how am I going to do that? I don't have any yet. Well, this is where you start out with a lower price in your first few franchises. And as you grow in value and visibility in the marketplace, you'll raise the price of your franchises. But there's going to be some people who are going to get in early, and in a few years, they could be absolutely delighted at the fact that they got in cheap. And when they go to sell their franchise somewhere in the, near, in the future, when they're ready to retire or move on to other things, they're going to have a very valuable asset in their hands. So you're doing something great here. You're putting people to work in their own business and helping them employ others. And what a way to live your life.